Good evening, Wrightsville. Donna Pinckney here. For Thursday night's evening devotion this week, we're bringing you another in our series of prayer practices. Each Thursday night in August, we're offering the opportunity to learn a new prayer practice. And so this week, our practice is the daily examine, which sounds awful, but it's really not. It's not an examination in the way you think of it, but it is an examination of sorts, um, an examination of your day. Thus, the daily exam. Um, it's a practice that's over 400 years old. Um, it was first developed by Saint Ignatius Loyola, and um, it's just a prayer reflection of your day in order to see God's presence in that day and to discern direction. So, I'm going to walk you through the four steps of this practice. As always, this is all available to you to print. There's a PDF attached to this file where you can go and print this and, you know, look back over it during your week. We hope we'll find that you will find it meaningful. So, step one, become aware of God's presence. So, maybe you want to light a candle, or maybe you get to get a quiet place, whatever that means for you. Become aware of God's presence and then look back over your day in the company of the Holy Spirit. Ask the Holy Spirit to bring some clarity and understanding to the events of the day. Okay, so here's the first question. When did you feel closest to God in your day? If you could relive one moment, what moment would that be? When you were most able to give and receive love? Reflect on that moment. Breathe in the gratitude you felt and receive life again from that moment. When did you feel farthest from God? When were you least able to give and receive love? Ask yourself what was said and done in that moment. Take deep breaths and let God's love fill you just as you are. And then give thanks for today and look forward to tomorrow. Um, ask God to, to give you light for tomorrow's challenges. Pay attention to the feelings that surface as you survey what's coming up in your day tomorrow. And just, you know, again, breathe in the thanks for today and look forward to tomorrow. Praying for wisdom, praying for discernment, praying for clarity and all those things. Just inviting the Holy Spirit to be a part of every part of your day and to learn from what you discern through that prayer. And that's it. See, not hard at all, not hard at all. Become aware of God's presence. When were you closest to God? When were you farthest from God? Thank you for today. What's coming tomorrow? You can do this. We can do this, we can. So, I'm grateful to have this opportunity with you on Thursday evenings to talk through prayer practices and I'll see you again next Thursday. So until then, have a wonderful week, Wrightsville. Good evening.